looking that way. Brock changes his mind, looks downfield, has a man if he can hit him. All the way into the end zone, up they fight for it, touchdown! Reaching up over the top is going to be Woodson. Come. Thank you so much for your time, Mr. McCormick. Well, have a great time tonight. Thank you. This is Ben on the back to the top. I tell you, the okay. back to the top. Blitz coming up the middle quickly, running right past the blitz. Jefferson, Johnson again on the pull, fall right in behind him, and I'm telling you. That block down into the hole. And here it comes again, straight through. That's going to go right into the end zone. Yep. Wow. Got it down. The kick is up. The kick is no. Looking, looking. Has his man up over the middle yeah. again. Going to get picked off. He could possibly take this to the house. He's going to take it right out. Run. Comes up again. Leaning himself forward. Can he get into the end zone? He yeah. does. That Give him the ball. There touchdown. And again, look what Gage would have done. We, we knew going in, if that offense could take on that defense, this was going to be Citrus Hill game. And I'll tell you, one of the guys right. who I got to give kudos to is going to be Robinson. Here, here we go now. And, Coach and Mr. McCormick will be awarding the torch to Coach. Right on, Coach Zomwald. Outstanding game tonight. Fantastic sportsmanship. Your team, all your support staff, we're so proud of you guys. It's an honor to award you the torch. I think it needs a paint job. Hey, hey, look at this. This is what high school football is about. This is what rivalries are about. Look at how much fun this is. God bless America. I love football. And these guys know each other. And when they're 55 years old, 60 years yeah, old, still you know what they're going to be talking oh, about? Yeah. They're going to be talking about that time when you couldn't stop us and we just stuck 138 yards right down your throat because that's exactly what they did tonight and how, and how, and how apropos that, that the superintendent of Val Verde School District just got done saying exactly what he said. It's time to get out the paint cans. Paint job. And it's time to get out the paint cans. So we start looking at Citrus Hill. Hey, is this the team to be in Division Three football? Doing something vanilla, a lot of it, and they're gonna punch you right in the face. Oh, they do it so, so well. They do it well, and, I, and for me, I gotta look at Robinson. I love the way he plays football. I like the way his color comes out there with with, uh, with Estelle. They seal on the outside, and then with Sandoval, the way he's able to control that on the inside, and then Johnson, the guards, and Reisling, the center. You know, you just can't say enough, and I'm not gonna forget about the other offensive guard. I'm gonna get you right into this right now. That's gonna be Afamenta. He, he does a great, great job all the way through. So we got Coach Zoe. Coach, what do you have to say? Thank you. I'm here with Coach Hallmalt. Uh, first of all, congrats on your win tonight. And what was the most challenging part of the game? Um, you know, just us trying to finish drives and play our best, which is the challenge every every week. I mean, there's obviously when it's Rancho, there's a little more emotion and there's a few more people show up, but we're trying to, to build something special and work towards the championship. So tonight, we just we had moments where we, we felt like we were in control of the game and then we gave it back to them. Um, who had a big night on your team, and why did this player stand out? You know, you know for us, our, our O-line did a great job uh, opening up holes for Jonathan Jefferson and, and Patelli and, and Earl. So uh, up front, I think, I think we had a, for the most part, we did a, a great job. And finally, what does this win mean to you? That we're four and up, and we got another game next week. Thank you so much. Uh, thank you for all your time, and uh, congrats again. This is Brenda Romero, now back to the top. And hey, Coach. We say it all the time. Good programs, you know what they say? Next one up. Next one up. And that's exactly where we're going to go with this. Coach, great where, job. Where are we next week? I think we're back over to see Rancho Verde. No, next week we're at we Orange, Orange Vista. Vista. No, we're not. Next week we're not at <laughs> Orange Vista. We, were. we don't know where we, don't we know are. We don't know where we are I'm going to be week. with my kids eating ice cream then. That's what <laughs> it sounds like. And I'm going to tell you something. I'm going to get the sprinkles, the chocolate syrup, and I'm going to slap it all over my kids' faces like this and rub it on them. Get ready, boys. Daddy's coming home. 
with a plate full of ice cream for your chin. You better look out. Here comes the ham bone. We're out of here. Citrus Hills, the winner.